if I have a full analog setup, so say I've got a KH310s and a KH810 subwoofer, can I get that or do I have to change things? This is not possible. So at least one component needs to be DSP based. So either the monitors themselves or the subwoofer, the KH750 DSP, which you have to be to, to put into your system. So I know that the KH750 is a, well, a subwoofer that will support a stereo system. What do I do if I've got a 5.1, 7.1 setup? This is the very first release of our automatic monitor alignment system and it supports stereo. So it supports 2.0 sources, means you can connect a stereo signal and have a base managed stereo system with as mentioned KJ80s, 120s, whatever, also in combination with the subwoofer. But it doesn't support currently more than those uh, two channels coming from the source um, because the only DSP monitor we currently have is the KH750 DSP and it just supports, as you mentioned, stereo. So you said back at the beginning that this is version one. I take it that means we've got a bit of an update cycle coming for this. We concentrated with this first version on the real core of, 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 the, of the algorithm. So to, to squeeze out the, the, the last bit uh, of, of your room acoustics in combination with the loudspeakers. The feature set, the, the amount of loudspeakers which are supported by the system uh, is going to be improved over, over the next uh, period of time. Thank you so much for taking us through that. That's, that's given us a, a, a lot to, to digest and a lot to understand and it's shown that we have some very, very uh, cool products. This is going to take uh, normal monitors to a different level. So thank you once again, Marcus. That was absolutely brilliant. Thanks, John. It was a pleasure. I hope you learned a bit and I also hope it was interesting for you. So stay in touch and we inform you as soon as we have new products and new features for our new software.